Hey, hello, welcome back to my new video, guys. It's Sampathy watching Sampath Sanfix Poco XC custom ROM reviews. Evolution X, one more update. Within a day, they gave one more update. This is a March 18th build, and the kernel has been changed here. 4.14.272 Snappy Hot kernel has been used here, and March 5th security patch, and Snow 6.2 Surya version with Android 12.1 that's fine actually selling status is enforcing this is really a major update in my opinion if you watched the previous two videos on evolution x there it wasn't that stable or it's not cooked properly but this particular rom it's really going to be good we'll be going to see what all the benchmark results cpu throttling test and bgmi gameplay everything will be explained stay tuned till the end of the video and regarding some of the evolver settings you can watch me previous video and by the way if you're first time to this channel hit that subscribe button consider subscribing my channel if you're first time and if you like the video give it a like and also allow that bell notification to get a video first to you and here we go this is the cpu throttling test results i have been running from last seven minutes and 10 seconds you can see here performance over time graph you can see it's cool enough just minimum is 110 and average is 133 and maximum is 151 gi ps that's this is how the cpu throttling does it's fine not just that see the android benchmark results how it has changed drastically 3 lakh 48 thousand where was in previous build it was 2 lakh 78 thousand and 0.5 degree celsius was the temperature raise and two percent of battery has been drained during this testing that's how it is you can definitely try it out as a gaming rom also this one let's see the geekbench results here too it's impressive scores not great but still it's very good 547 single score and 1418 is the multi score this is because of the kernel used here is linux 4.14.272 snappy hot kernel has been used in this particular rom yeah. this is evolution x 6.2 with march 18 latest build i will give the link to the description and you can follow same flashing method which was i made in the previous video or even the a week ago video also you can watch that same method to flash the rom just instead of that rom file use this rom file which is in the description you can download it and flash it successfully no problem regarding that coming into dialer here also it's fine let me increase the volume there's the volume panel you get as you can see direct video call feature is available in this room still it's there and the call recording is also there but the other person will notify that you are recording the call that's how it was in the previous build too here also same that's not the change here and into settings into the evolver into miscellaneous here you get these options you need to enable this unlimited photo storage if you want that unlimited photo storage in google photos you need to enable this and unlock high fps in game this is very important if you turn this on then only you will get like for example if you're playing bgma then you will get up to 90 fps you will get and unlock higher quality streams whenever you're watching the ott application this is going to help you these things are present in the evolver setting into the miscellaneous settings you need to enable that then only you will get those settings and into battery and battery thermal profiles are given battery life if it is recorded yeah it is recorded i charged a little bit charging speeds are also very good in this particular room the performance is also good and charging time and battery life you can see here screen on time of 43 minutes that's fine enough you will get six to eight hours of screen time with heavy usage note this down and into camera application i have installed this arno build gcam if you want you can use any other gcam ports also but this one will come with wide angle lens support then in, if you want any other gcam ports you can definitely try it as of now anx camera support is not available in this particular and at all roms for poco xc nfc or surya or karna whatever you call when they will fix it i don't know and payment applications are also working fine without wasting time let's say the battlegrounds mobile and before that i'll show the security options here you get face unlock and fingerprint unlock and app lock is also pre-installed no need to worry no need to install any third party applications for that let me show you the fingerprint unlock as you can see it's again taking a second delay but it's accurate enough as you can see that they need to fix in upcoming builds most of the things they have fixed from one day like later like uh, previous build it was some 
not stable enough because of kernel whatever the reason but now it's very good and because of that i made this video again face unlock it's also pretty quick let me show you as you can see the face unlock is also working fine you can use the face unlock instead of fingerprint unlock as of now this build having that little bit of delay in fingerprint sensor let's see the bj man end of the video i hope you are liking this video hit that like button guys and see into the sanok match arm and graphics up to 90 fps is enabled i will keep it 90 fps only and let's see how it handle in sanok boot camp auto matching i have removed I am not in a big level like Ace or anything like that. just gold this account is testing account main accounts I stopped playing BJMI for some reason I don't like it before I was playing lot more but now I stopped playing and brightness is also fine you can see here the quick settings panels are also working fine enough everything you want to know more about this rom any features i missed you can check out the previous videos there i explained plenty about this rom evolution x i made already two videos the last build one and before that a week ago you can check out if want i can give the cards to that here and loudness is also pretty loud you may not hear that because microphone is near me not with the phone but it's loud that what i can say you need to trust that not that loud compared to me mint also that you need to keep in mind No one came here, I think so. Not laggy also. this time no one landed unfortunately let me go somewhere else okay here there are bots maybe not the players as you can see there is a bot Even while car driving also, okay, enemy is there, car driving was also fine, as you can see, there is enemy, let's take him, I hope so, I take him, okay, he was ready, as you can see, the graphics are same enough, smooth and 90 FPS, let's see, Definitely much better than yesterday's build of Evolution X. My recommendation is to keep to smooth plus extreme, it's more than enough even in classic matches. Only if you want to show off your 
actual performance then you can use 90 fps that's what i can say because in 90 fps it will get warm if you play continuously that too you need to keep in mind if you want to play like one hour and like that then you can play in 90 fps okay i'll come back that's all guys in this video the performance is very good charging speeds are very good and ch battery life is also very good and if you want to use this arnobel g cam you can dm me in insta i'll give the links everything is perfect in this room except here and there like fingerprint sensor is a little bit slower and maybe some random bugs for some people apart from that everything is working fine you can definitely try it out as a daily driver that's my conclusion for this evolution x if you like the video give it a like and if you still not subscribe to my youtube channel hit that subscribe button down below and thank you for watching guys we'll meet you with another interesting video until that keep smiling bye bye for now